Hi, my name is Jess. I'm going to introduce myself. Um, we have this collab channel, which you'll see above. But basically, I'm 28 years old. I basically am interested in makeup and beauty related things. That's what drew me to YouTube. And then it kind of got sidetracked into other things. But yeah, I work in an office, which I really don't like. Um, eventually I want to be in a position where I can actually work for myself because I think that will be the only way that I'll be truly happy working because I just I never had a respect for authority I basically go by my own logic and rules and I don't like to follow rules that don't make sense but anyway I eventually want to get into jewelry design which I already have my own website and everything and I already do design jewelry unlike a I guess lower level I don't know what you would call it <clears throat> which I'll post my site below but basically I want to eventually get into like where I'm actually designing settings and things like that that you would see it like sales or whatever but like my own jewelry line and that will take you know you know learning how to solder and do castings and all that good stuff which I don't have the equipment to do but anyway like I said if you check out my site below you'll see what I'm talking about as far as what I do now but it's slowly progressing but I don't want to talk too much about that but eventually I do want to have that as my main job which is designing jewelry and selling jewelry because that's what I'm passionate about I've always been artistic um, it started off writing just small stories poetry and it segued to like drawing which I'm not super good at drawing because I just don't have the patience for it and I have problems writing because I wrote so much as I was you know younger and I type all day because that's I work in the office so I type all day I'm on the computer all day and it's just really strenuous on your hands <clears throat> especially if you're not in the right positioning like ergonomic positioning whatever which is why I wear these hematite bracelets it, they do help but yeah so anyway um did that. I like to sing. Um, I write poetry, short story, well not short stories, books. Eventually that's another thing I do want to do is get published. But my plan is basically to start off doing the jewelry thing once that gets going. Of course I'll have to have a side job until that, you know, gets popular or makes enough money to where that can actually be a job like a full-time job and then once I get older because you know making jewelry is very you know again you know your hands are involved and things like that um, as I get older that might not be feasible and um, I do eventually want to get published which um, I could have been published already with one of my books but after looking into the publishing group that wanted to publish me there was like some shady things that people had said so I didn't want to get involved in that so either I'll be doing research on a legitimate company like down the line or publishing on myself but anyway so that's my goals um, as far as like what I want to do in life and all that um, currently I live by myself uh, just me and my cat <laughs> uh, which is Momo she's um, five years old she's a tabby um, she's usually hanging around when I do videos but for some reason she's not tonight but um yeah I'll be moving again soon um, in October so I'll have like a more this bang is driving me insane I'll have like a more legitimate setup than I have like right now I know this is going to look weird, but my hair is driving me insane. 
anyway, um, I'll have like a more jet legitimate setup than what I do now because like right now my apartment's just a complete mess um, I don't really have like a stable station where I do videos or anything like that so when I move uh, there'll be I already have like the area that I'll be you know, setting up just for that and making jewelry so it'll be more um, I want for lack of a better word professional um, other things that I'm interested in are the paranormal, which I've had a lot of experience with all throughout my life, mainly when I was a teenager. Not so much now, but I think it's just because I'm so stressed out from work, mainly, that my energy level is just so low that nothing really happens. So I find that the times that I get the most activity or experiences are when my energies at a, like a higher level and I just don't have that right now plus I kind of shut myself off to it which you know if you're not into that kind of thing you probably have no idea what I'm talking about but um, yeah I do believe that's something you can for the most part turn on and off maybe not completely but if you're interested in that you can check out my other channel which also talks about makeup and jewelry and paranormal things and it goes into detail about the things that I've experienced. But I don't want to get too in depth with that here. Um, other things are... Um, like I said, I write. Um, I like video games. Mostly like first person shooters and like slashing fighting games like Dynasty Warriors, things like that. Um, I have a PS3, uh, which I love. I grew up on PlayStation, like the Xbox is okay, but I find the controllers to be too bulky for my hands and they're just not very comfortable. And I don't know, I just, my first um, higher platform type thing was a PlayStation. <clears throat> so that's just kind of like what I grew up on. Um, doo -doo 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 -doo. Yeah. I don't really know what else to talk about. Um, I guess my style would be... I'm not very... I wouldn't say I'm not very girly, but I'm not really. Like, I do love makeup, but that's mostly for from an artistic point of view. Um, apparently I don't find it absolutely necessary to wear. I'm not wearing anything right now. But um, I do feel more comfortable, especially if I'm like going out, like whatever, with makeup on. Um, I don't always. It depends, you know, on how I feel. Um, I'm not the per type of person that is dependent on it, but I do feel more comfortable when I do have it on. But I think that's pretty much human nature is you feel better about yourself when you look better. Um, as you can see, I'm not very like into fashion type things and it's not because I don't appreciate it, it's just the fact that I'm not in the position to um, really be into it too much right now. Uh, mainly because of you know financial reasons and stuff like that and I just don't at this time in my life I don't feel that it's like super important <clears throat> but you know as I get because like I'm in a really transitional stage right now so after I move I think that things will be a lot different a lot more different than they are now and um, hopefully I'll be a lot happier but yeah um, <laughs> my cat just like, I hate when she does it, she like will look at something, like she sees something, and my first inclination is that it's a bug, because I hate bugs, but she'll like look at it, and it freaks me out because I think it's a bug, and then I look and there's nothing there. And she does it like all the time. But anyway, um, I think it's about it. Um, 
like I said, we're just introducing kind of like ourselves this week. Um, if you have any questions, I guess you can put them below. 